this case gone, how many secrets they are hiding from me? How many? I want to slap that Sana for hurting Masana. Left her on the dustbin to die. Thanks to Mr. Kim who did the serious, I would lost my mind. Shooting her on the spot. How can we show one that much cruel? You are totally frustrated knowing they are hiding many more things but not opening their mouth while feeling they have something fishy about Mr. Kim's behavior with Miss Wyatt. Explain how he treated her not letting her call that. He never gave the same care to the both girls why and I flinched when my phone suddenly vibrated made me jump. I look at the caller ID. It's none other Mr. Han Ji Hoon made me sigh. Like seriously, he's literally eating my mind since yesterday. What he want from me? I already told him I mean why I'm not his sister, but this breath. I took a deep breath and received the call. Mr. Han, what's wrong with you? Can't you understand I'm getting irritated by your non-stop calls and... First, listen to me carefully. I was trying to ask why you went to access KVR last night. He directly asked, made you get confused by his sudden question, but it made you angry. Are you stalking me? Then how did you know I went there at night? It's a coincidence. I also went there. The grave you were talking, it's our mother's cave. Han, Hannah, stop joking. She's my mother, not yours. And I'm not your sister. No, she's our stepmother, her wife's mother, my stepsister. No, she's my mother, I mean Hyungja's wife, and then why her surname is that mean? Why Han, huh? Because mom used her father's surname, that's why. How is this possible after marriage? I don't want to know what, when, how. The thing is, I'm not a sister, and I really don't want to be. After knowing the fact about your family, who tortured an innocent girl, blamed her for her own mother's death, treated her like a trash, did every possible thing so she can get hurt. Nah, thank you, but I don't want to, to be. And you are screaming, you are my sister, you are my sister. Okay, fine. I hear you literally bullied her in middle school with your friends, hurting her. Can be a brother do this type of things with his sister because of some illiterate talks? Where the common sense is completely missing. I'm sorry to say, but you are a failure as a brother. Listen, I don't want to fight with you. I'm talking to you just sick of this case or else I really don't have to listen your I hang you I know I'm a failure as a brother I heard it her but in middle school I influenced by that word thinking she is the reason why mom died she killed her that time I was not in a measure to know about this but trust me after knowing this I tried to protect her but it's a tough finish because I'm hanging. Wait, can I ask you a favor? I want you to prove me wrong. I want you to prove me you are really not my sister. Now how I'm going to prove that I'm not a sister? Time skip after 30 minutes. You are sitting on the bed staring at no one. At the jungle enter inside the room holding two cup coffee. He noticed you are being thrown out, so he softly called your name. It made your little flinch look up saw him throwing over you. Drink twist, you will feel better. You took the cup, started to drink. Something is bothering you. But why I'm feeling something is really bothering you. I never saw you like this. Zone out. Coke, it's nothing. Actually, I was thinking about Hanoi, how she had to go tall from the little age. I was thinking to God giving me this life, a father who can do everything 
just to see my smile a brother who have overprotective a best friend who can kill anyone just to keep me safe even did not think twice to should have boyfriend in the last You say smiling but there are jungles staring at you knowing about whom you are talking, feeling bad once upon a time the person was you, sweet, innocent, good hearted. Yes, you are. So now, are you feeling better? Let's sleep, I am really sleepy. You sleep, I am going to take a warm shower. Do you want me to join you? Yes, let's go. He threw me on his shoulder, holding my legs tightly, knowing what I am capable to do it. I started to hit on his back, thinking he would stop, instead got a hard spank. Time skip after 30 minutes, Jungle come out from the washroom rubbing his head, having a satisfied grin on his face. It was so good, but I hope she won't kill me for the non-stop obsession. I literally made her breathless, that's why I ran from the washroom. He sat on the bed after wearing a comfortable cloth while applying medicine on his knuckles. When his eyes landed on your phone, which is on the bed, saw some messages popping on the screen. He took the phone about to power off knowing it will be work related, it's gonna give you more stress, but stopped after saw your brother's message, his eyes literally grown bigger reading the messages. Throw the blurry glass door, then slide himself under the blanket, pretended to be asleep. You come out, got taken aback after saw him sleeping. Is he really sleeping without me or my phone? Now what? He took the phone, noticing keep vibrating. It's none other Jihoon. She read the messages, then look at Jungkook biting your lips. Jungkook peeked from the corner, saw you clenching your hand. Skip next day at hospital. You came out after giving blood, so June and Ari sitting on the bench waiting for you. What? Said catching everyone's attention. They look at you before approaching you. Are you okay? Yes, it's just the injection. I took bullets, so it's whatever. Can I leave now? I work. But the reports? Reports will out tomorrow after 1 pm. I told them to give us a two copies, so now I'm leaving. Before they could say something, you went from there. After minutes, they also went out. Without noticing, someone is standing in front of the door wearing a mask. He directly went to the laboratory, stand for a while when he saw a compounder coming out. He approached him and asked, I want you to change this blood sample to mean one sample. And who the hell are you? Do you know it's illegal? And I'm the king of every illegal ass. He pulled out his mask, made the compounder shock as hell. Mean Yungi, I mean, you don't have to mean anything, just exchange the blood with her, I will give you. Money how much you want, understood? He nodded his hand and took the blood sample, he was literally trembling, and went from there. He about to went from there, but noticed the figure on the corner made him look at the corner. He checked, but there was no one, he shook it off. Then went out. After a second, the person came out from the corner and released the deep sigh. God, he didn't saw me or else the whole thing I was creating, everything could get ruined. But I guess he did no more. Chase the blood sample. 
I should leave now before someone saw me. Time skipped the result and you are looking down because your uncle was trying that player to you. Same goes the Park and Han family. We all know the reason why you are here in this hospital, huh? Actually, I dare to lie, Ryan. Results won't be good. It was a coincidence. I came here for a information and saw you with them. Looking down and hold hem of his shirt, started the pull, made him look down at you. You hear him say, There are the other members. Mr. Han, DNA reports are here. You go up there saliva, look at Jungkook who is staring at you, raising his one eyebrow. You again look down, look at Ji Hoon who ran to the doctor and took the boots. Well, that's why I'm here. I know the results, so... What happened, Mr. Han? You asked him after saw him looking disappointed. It's negative. this possible you it's possible because she is not a sister from the starting i was silent because i also wanted to show you yes she is meanwhile so from now never dare to meet her expect the kiss related things understood he hold your hand and started to drag with him she was away him like a video child she is really not a one i 